y'all? It is me, Zarela, and I am back with another mug and video. So today we're gonna be playing a brand new life simulation game. It's called Ooblitz. Ooblitz is a farming creature collection town life game where you can build up your farm, befriend townsfolk, grow Ooblitz, and have some dance-offs. Like, how fun is that? So if you don't know what Ooblitz are, Ooblitz are these cute little creatures right here, as you can see on the screen. They are the cutest little things that you can just collect and have dance-offs with them. It's just really a cute game, y'all. So yes, I'm partnering up with Epic Games to bring you this Ooblitz video. So I've been obsessed with Ooblitz, y'all. I've been playing it since it came out and I just can't stop playing it. Every time I have free time, I'm playing Ooblitz, okay? You can ask anybody in my family. <laughs> If you didn't know, Ooblitz is now available on the Epic Games Store in Early Access. So go ahead and use my link down below to download Ooblitz today. So thank you, Epic Games, for sponsoring this video. Let's just get right into business. All right, y'all. So we are now in the game. And as you can see, mine says load game because I have been playing. So I'm on day 23, so as you can see, I've been playing for a little bit, as much as I can. I've been playing 23 days in the game. <laughs> so yeah, I'm really excited to go ahead and get started in this. So we're gonna go ahead and click new game. And y'all, this game has the best music. So hopefully I can keep the music in the video, but just know this music is bomb, so get ready. So let's just go ahead and click new game. What's your name, buddy? Spell it out. Um, my name is Zarela. <laughs> Gunny. And I love this game because it has like cute little sayings. Y'all will see. Hey there, Zarela. How do you want to look? Okay, so we get to pick our skin color. And then we have a couple hairdos. Um, okay, I'm gonna go with um Let's see, do we want the pigtails? Okay, so I had this to start off with my other one. So I'm gonna think I think I'm gonna do the pigtails. And then we get to pick our hair color. And you know what? I'm gonna go with pink. They got brown, blonde, black. I thought that was green. <laughs> Gray and pink. And I'm gonna go with pink. Okay, now we get to pick our outfit. And yes, this game has a shop where you can buy your own clothes, and it has a shop where you can go and get your hair done so we will be changing up our hair and stuff once we get enough money um so i'm gonna put on this one's the cutest okay so i feel good let's go your life has been a giant toot so far you spent all of that tooty life on the isolated Alro Island, where the people are stuffy and there aren't even any ooblets. <gasps> no ooblets? I would hate to live that life. I'm so glad I am leaving. That's why you decided to leave, yes. I'm so glad that I'm leaving because a life without ooblets? What? Look at me, I'm cute on a boat. You're off to the distant shores of mainland Oob, a place you've only heard vague tales of, a fabled land of oddity, creativity, and <laughs> ooblets. Yeah! Look at the little ooblets. Okay, that's an ooblet, that's an ooblet. <laughs> Mayor Tinsel. Oh, little boy. Are you from the Ooblet High Council? Is this a surprise inspection? Did I fail? I, uh, no. I'm Zarela from Aro Island. Oh, then how do? Welcome to Badge Town. My name is Tinsel. Oh, and I'm the mayor. What can I help you with? Um, I'm looking to start a new life somewhere, you know, possibly here, because he's looking good. I see the little Ooblets everywhere. <laughs> Splenda. Were you looking to buy a house? Maybe invest in the local economy? Uh, well, <laughs> I don't have no money or no skills or personal possessions, so... You. A true entrepreneur, then. I can work with this, though. Yeah, I've been needing a helper for my ever-expanding mayoral task list. 
And there's an old abandoned farmhouse you can have if you help me with all the junk I gotta do around here. <gasps> you win? Free houses just don't get offered any every day. Girl, I mean, you, you ain't have to ask me twice, shoot. What can I help with first? Fantastic. First off, wait, where are your ooblets? Um, I don't have any. They don't have any ooblets where I'm from. It was lame and boring. Huh? Not even an Uga? It's gonna be tough to do much without Ubers here. Well, your local Uber cut. Well, your local. Well, your local Uber cut. <laughs> Y'all, this is hard. This is hard to say. Y'all say local Uber Club. Local Uber Club. Local Uber Club. Local Uber. That's a tongue twister. Well, your local Uber Club will probably be able to give you one. What Uber Club are you yeah. in? Um, you know, I just said we didn't have any Ublet, so we don't have any Ublet clubs where I'm from either. Uh, what sort of... No bother. You can join one here. Let me fetch our local club leaders and you can introduce yourself to some town folk in the meantime. Yes, let's meet the people here. A hey, talk to eight people. All right. So we move around with WASD. I'm using my keyboard. Let's go and talk to Aira. Hey, Aira. Digging your whole dilly you've got going on. Very confused cheek. Oh. I'm Zarela and I'm new here. Oh. My fave type of person, one I don't know yet. I'm Aira. Hey Aira girl, yes. This is gonna be my best because she's cute. And she the first one we met. So so we're gonna make her our best friend, okay? And then who is this? Milu. I'm, I'm Milu. I saw your boat pull in. So, are you some sort of rich tourist come to buy all our postcards and novelty t-shirts? No, I'm Zarela and I'm looking to start a new life here. Oh, bleh. Oh, <clears throat> what am I supposed to do with all these novelty t-shirts? I don't know, my dude. <laughs> I'm not finna buy them, I know that. Ooh, look. Can I go pick this up? Look at this, it's glam and it's ready for me to pick it up. Okay, let's go finish talking to 10 people. Who do we have around here? Ooh. New Ooblet spotted. Look, the little lump stump. Oh, look at this little Ooblet and they're following me. <laughs> so cute. Oh, we found another one, the clomper. Oh, I think the clompers are really cute. And then there should be some more around here, but I definitely want me a clomper. Lump sumps are probably my least favorite, but they still cute. Oh. Look at me. How do you dearie? My number's not up, is it? I'm Zarela. I'm moving to the old farmhouse. Oh, goody. I'm me, and I run the little garden shop here, so I guess we'll be seeing a lot of each other. Oh. If you have any spare produce, you can sell it to me. And if anyone starts asking too many questions, tell me first. Y'all, I get out of character. It's so bad. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, we got some more townspeople over here. We got a little Taffy. I like a little Taffy. Taffy do. Yes, it's true. Okay then. I'm sorry, little. Go away now. <laughs> okay, Taffy. Well, Dang. Okay, and then we got Rugnolia, my other fave. She gonna be our second bestie, okay? Are you the research assistant I requested three years ago? No, I'm just still here. I'm sorry, look. Introductions, okay, sure. I'm Rugnolia, and I operate the learnery, which serves a variety of purposes. Too complicated to get right in, to get into right now. Okay, and if you're going to be sticking around, you should have this. Well, she gave me the grumbo, the grumboy, the grumboire. I don't know how to say it, but it's a cute little book. It keeps track of all your tasks, items, friends, that sort of thing. How does it do all that? Science, magic, and junk. You'll figure it all out, or you won't. I have no metric of your aptitude of these sorts of things. <laughs> Open your grumboire with tab. I don't know how to say that, y'all. But okay, so let's open our gum rare. So look, it's so cute. My face is all up in the way, but basically, here I am right here. I'm looking cute as ever. I'm level one. Um, we have the wishy well. We have wishes. We can just go to and buy stuff, y'all. We'll get into that later. Um, see, we have a lovely tavern. We can 
take off our clothes, put on our clothes and stuff. Um, and it's all categorized and stuff. We're gonna have accessories, backpacks, shoes, outfits, bottoms, and shirts. There's so much with this game, y'all. Um, and then there's a furniture tab and then a tab we don't know about. We have a tab about friends and we have a couple more towns people to meet. Um, we have a ooblets tab, which we don't have any ooblets. We have a badges tab where we can um, get some badges by completing some tests. And we have an alamet, which shows us each and every ooblet we can collect, which there are multiple of them, and I can't wait to get them all. Um, we have the crops over here, the recipes for everything, and we have found items right here. All right, so let's go ahead and talk to Paul. Oh, howdy doody. Looking for a bun. I don't know what voice I want to give him. I don't think so. I'm just moving into town. Huh? To Bash Town? Well, I'm poked. Local Bungalbee delivery fellow. Here's a little gift from the Bungalbee company to welcome you to town. <gasps> Thank you. Nice and soft. A good source of energy. Contains 40 energy. He gave me 10 Bungalbee buns. Thank you. They're the finest prepackaged treaties in Ulo. Eat Bungalbee buns for a quick, easy boost to your energy and mood properly. He said probably. <laughs> wow. So he don't even know if it'll boost my mood. Double. Hey, double girl. A customer. What can I get you? Bee juice? Spressy? Sorry, I don't actually have any money. Not winning customer of the month so far. Well, when you do scrounge up some money, it's been here at Cuddle Cups. I'm double, and I serve the best and only bee juice in town. Yes, so she owns this little cute little Cuddle Cups Cafe where we can go and buy some drinks and all that type of stuff and we can sell stuff to her. We ran into a new ooblet, the little Fleeble. Hey, Fleeble baby, it looks like a little mushroom. <laughs> okay, and then we have to talk to one more person. So let's just walk over here. Oh, okay, here, here, here. Here is Charles. Hey, Charles. You're standing awfully close to me. Hey. Oh, hi. I'm Sarayla, and I'm new in town. I suppose you'll be wanting to know my name now, huh? Hey. That's okay. You can tell me when you're ready. Okay, fine. I'm Charles. I make clothes in my shop. Come on, bye. Huh? I shake your hand, but I don't do that. Okay. <laughs> Splenda. Everyone is here now. So, basically... Ooblet Cubs are little social groups that have each of their own themes and personalities. These are our local Ooblet Club leaders. I thought I'd let them each give you a quick pitch to see what they're about. Guys, we're going to join the Ooblet Club. Okay, this is Melda. We'd love to have you join Friend Buns. We're delightful. Friend Buns and Tud, the club for sweet kitties who love cute things. And this, this is the Ooblet Club that I've joined in the game that I'm playing playing myself so we're gonna join a different ooblet club but yeah friend buns is for cute things we have basil with peak snubs peak snubs don't do pitches you should be pitching to me <laughs> peak snubs the club of born leaders strong competitors and just generally successful people and then we have my sprouts this is from outgrid oh no so basically my sprouts is the club for woodsy outdoorsy type who love a good adventure and then we have Mimpins the club for clever people who aren't very good at social interactions so I think this since I'm already in front months in my own little game I'm going to be joining my sprouts my second choice that I wanted to be a part of a club for woodsy outdoorsy types who love a good adventure I love a good adventure so we're gonna go ahead and join Outgrid in my sprouts and we're gonna be getting this cute little ooblet right here <laughs> yes you'll be a great my sprout here's a new pout to start your adventure with <laughs> look at my baby <laughs> hey baby <laughs> y'all I'm treating us like a little baby ah uh, you two look like a perfect match yes we do we do we do yes we do look at my baby now that you've gotten an ooblet, you should try getting into a dance-off. Ooblets are mysterious creatures and they apparently love dancing. This is very important to them. All we can do is support their interests and set up elaborate, contrived, competitive dance scenarios for them to show off in. You'll be amazed at the sort of conflicts that get resolved through the medium of dance. 
Oh, here comes our worthy competitor to let you practice. Well, we finna get into our first dance off a, a, a dance challenge from Lump Stump. Okay, I'm ready. Here's where you pick which ooblets you want to dance. You only have one so far, so it's an easy choice. So we're gonna go against Lump Stump and we finna get ready. Hey, our first our first dance off a hey, each turn you draw random dance moves for you to choose from so this game is so cute because as you level up your ooblets you um get more dance moves to perform and more cards and it just gets tricky like in the beginning the dance off seem all quick and easy and stuff but once you keep playing these dance offs do get hard you have some basic moves that will always be available each ooblet also has its own unique move like i just said with some experience they can learn new moves. Moves cost beats and you get fresh beats to use every turn. Um, to start with, you'll draw four moves and have three beats per turn. Um, some moves increase your points, lower your opponents, or do other junk. The goal is to get to this number of points before your opponents. So we're trying to get to 20 points before our opponent lets them. So um, we can shake it and earn six points, or we can um, earn two points with the little Landy. We can do the Rig a Jig and add a move to our hand, or we can gain a hype. The hype increases the power of dance moves. So we have three beats. I'm gonna go ahead and earn six points. Look at my little Oobly dancing. <laughs> So cute. And then I'm gonna use my little Lindy and earn two points. Hey, my Oobly did that. And now I'm gonna end my turn. And now it's your turn. So he gained three points in one height. He earned two points with the Twizzle Sizzle. Okay, so there are five. We're at eight. So we're already doing good. Um, we got three more beats. So we can do all of these cost two. I'm definitely gonna do this one for earn um, six points and this is one of their special unique moves it's so cute let's do this shaky baby shaky shaky <laughs> hey okay now we have 14 points they did the dainty dip the twizzle sizzle oh they're catching up to us uh, we can't let that go down we're gonna have to hit them with the seven points the flip floss Hey, get it, yes, and we won. Y'all already knew, you already knew, cause my oblit's gonna be the best oblit dancers in the world. Shoot, I, I wanna make it to where we do not lose one battle, okay? We probably are, but now we have to get the seed from Lump Stump, y'all, and guess where this seed is gonna come from? Watch. Lump Stump, give me a seed, baby, you did good. Good job, little Lump Stump, you did great. <laughs> he just tooted out the little lump sub seed. <laughs> Plant me to grow a new friend. So yeah, that is basically how you collect creatures. So once you run into different creatures, you dance battle them and then you get their seed from them and then you plant them and when they're ready, they will be a part of your little ooblet gang. So it's really cute. Um, the mayor tinsel said, easy peasy. Anywho, you should head to your farmhouse now and get settled in. Yes, let's go check out our house, y'all. Let's go check out our house. So, we need to meet Tinsel at the farmhouse. So, we're just going to follow these arrows to our farmhouse. Um, I really just want to start collecting stuff, but I guess we can't right now. So, yeah, we are here with Mead and Mayor Tinsel. Tinsel looks like a little kid. I don't know. Is Mayor Tinsel a little kid? <laughs> I never noticed that. House. It's not much right now, but what do you expect for a free house? I'm sure you'll be able to fix it up and make it real pretty. Maybe add some bunting. Bunting oh. always helps. Wow, what a junkyard. I, I mean, a very unique property with a lot oh. of potential. Oh, well, she gave me some sweetie beady seeds. A sweet root vegetable which can be used to create fruit toast takes three days to grow. So she gave me three sweetie beady <laughs> seeds and a basic dirt scraper. Oh, scraper. Give it a shot. Just don't dig deeper, deeper than six feet down anywhere around here. Okay, uh, what's gonna happen if I dig six feet uh, down? Okay, and we can sh scroll through our hot bar with the left and right buttons. Press Q to enable farming mode. 
use a dirt scraper on the piece of layer to highlight it you find okay so um now we can use this little dirt scraper to till the ground i'm going to till three little spots and then we're going to go ahead and plant our little sweetie feeties and I want to have the cutest Ooh. farm ever eventually, but Splenda, now you just need to water it. Here's a dribbly can you can use. <laughs> Y'all, everything they say be so funny, like a dribbly can. <laughs> what the hell? A basic dribbler. Okay. <laughs> Fill it up with the water from the tap here and then use it to water your seeds. All right, I sure will. Let's go and fill it up. Get some water in it and let's go and water our seeds. Our little sweetie beauties. All right, so we're done with that. You got it. Now all you have to do is water the crops each day and harvest them once they're fully grown. You're already a pro at farming, maybe semi-pro. You'll improve. Anywho, you must be pretty tired, so get some rest and I'll check on, in on you tomorrow morning. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. Okay, so now we have to go to sleep. And look at our little house, y'all. Ooh, it's a mess. I cannot wait till we can upgrade it. But in our house, we have a little um, suitcase. We got an old luggage right here. Over here, we have a old hot plate where we can cook. We can cook a bunch of different stuff or it'll give us a bunch of energy and a lot of the stuff we have to bring to the townsfolk sometime. And oh y'all, it's just so cute. Okay, let's go to sleep. Get our beauty rest so we can start getting straight to work. Yes, okay, we're up. Now let's come outside. They said we have to water our plants every day. So actions like watering use up your energy. So yes, we have our energy bar over here and you can see how much energy you have here you can get your energy back by sleeping drinking bean juice and eating certain foods so we'll go ahead and water these sweetie beauties because they are dry as you can see and then they will be grown fully grown in three days it says go explore around a bit or something all right so let me just show y'all the whole little area we have so ooh, it's pretty hard to get around so i probably won't be able to but we got a big, like, nice, pretty, pretty nice size farm. And I believe you can expand it once you get a little bit more money. All right, y'all. So I took a little burger break. <laughs> Had to eat a little burger. But let's go and explore the town of Oob World. So here is a little board where it shows you where all the townsfolk are. Um, so I love this. So whenever I need to like bring something to Era, to Era, I'm gonna say Era. Um, anytime I need to bring something to Era, I know exactly where she at. Or if I need to go talk to a boat, I know where he at. Like I love this little map that shows you where everybody's at. So yeah. Um, and over here, this is Mead's Seeds. So you can come up in here and you can buy all type of different seeds. So, ooh, so we got Sweetie Beauties over here and we don't have no money to buy anything, so that's that. But the see Sweetie Beauties with this little red post on it, that means they're on sale. So if I had some money, I would love to have bought some, but we ain't got no money. And the money is gummy. So this is our money. This is the currency here in Oob World. Ooh, we found something on the floor. Moss Sprouts token. Thank you. Ooh. We got a token for our club. So those will come in handy later. And right here we have some cloth plant seeds, some mud seeds, some carrot seeds, and a drizzle dribbler. Ooh, I still haven't bought that in my current game, and I really need to. But I should have talked to meat, but whatever. Okay, so here's Fub Free. It's worth it's worth noting that I got up this morning. Okay, so this is Fub Free, and I think she's really cute, but I don't think she's a part of the game. She's not in my friends list, so which is really sad because I want to be friends with her. Like, and then we have another girl, Jubal, and I don't think she's a part of the 
um, part of the little thing where I could be friends with her either. So Glee Mates are just like normal Oplis, but I need them. Like, is she in here? She's not even in there, so. I guess those are just random people. Look at this wiggle whip. Okay, so we got a little cloth plant over here. We can collect this cloth let. And we have some button boys that we can collect. These are just a little stuff that we're gonna be using for our recipes and stuff. Gimbal over here. How do Sprout? You look like you're up for an adventure. I just moved to town. My name's Zarela. Sounds like you're ready. Um, you're already on an adventure. I'm Gimbal. Once I get my hot air balloon fixed, I'll be able to show you all around Oob. Thanks, girl. So we definitely gotta figure out how to get her a hot air balloon fixed. And this is Officer Zuffo. Oh, goody. Is that you, Plubbert? No, you're not Plubbert. Who are you? I'm Zarela. I just moved into oh, town. Goody. Well, how do you it? I'm Chief Officer Zuffle, Chief of Police, Postmaster, Notary Public, and Chief Commissioner of Woods and Forest. Oh. Welcome to the town. Let me know if you find out whatever happened to Plover. All right, I'll let you know. Let's continue up here. Here is Ara in her house. What? I wonder. Let me see. We can go inside of Spring's house. Let's go inside of Spring's house so I can show you. Um, the house. So basically, you can come into people's houses and you can collect the different things around their house. Kind of like stealing, but <laughs> um, yeah. Forging is an art, and by art, I mean you bend down and pick up stuff. Whoever this Eva is, I don't know who Eva is, but let's look in the fridge to see what we can get. Oh, a Karoo cake! Thank you. And over here, fructose. Yes, I need all this stuff. And what's under here? A nerdy. Ooh, definitely need that. Nerdies come in handsy, handsy. All right, let's come up here to Ara. Hey, girl. Hey, bestie. Daily, oh. Daily, oh. Oh yeah, I forgot. You're not from around here. Daily, oh. It's pretty common greeting around mainland Oob, I guess. That and how do? Okay. Um, we got a little spore bag over here and let's go into Aira's house y'all Aira's house is really cute look at her she got the little dog wallpaper and look at her bed and stuff over here let's look at this it's shiny so let's take a look at it I guess I can't look at it but we got a another little token and a recipe piece if we find like four of those recipe recipe pieces then we will be able to create get a um, full recipe so this is a potion of recalling the name of that guy from the movie about that thing a was into making potions and stuff so <laughs> that's why you would find some random poster i mean potions heavenly home let's go up in here this is a really cute house from in from the outside and it has cute little bunk beds we got a new badge incoming. This is from Mayor Tinsel. Hope Dob, you earned your first badge. We're all about badges here, so um, here's hoping I'll be awarding you with a bunch more. Check your grammar to see what for uh, for what other badges you can get. Thanks, Tinsel. So we got the badge of exploring. Look at ten thingy doodles. <laughs> Um, and we got a wishy. We got 40 wishy points. So let's look over here. Ooh, we got our first gummy. And we got a shell bow from the sea. All right. So we pretty much just went into that house and stole that girl's money, which is sad. But yeah, so you can go around and chop up these planks, and you will get some plank lights. Tiny bits of wood, and these will come in handy for crafting and stuff and stuff. And we'll just take this button boy. Over here is a dance bar, but it's locked. We cannot go into to there yet, but we will be able to um, further down the line. You will be able to have dance competitions and stuff here in the town of Oob. So here is Zimmy. Here's the Friend Buns Clubhouse. And then over here is the, I forgot, this is a clubhouse too. Um, 
you know, Basil's Clubhouse, the stuck up dude. We found another gummy. Now let's go into this cozy house. Ooh, it's very cozy. We got a friend fun token. We got another recipe piece. We got obsidian. Ooh. We got another gummy. What's over here? Another gummy. Oh, thank you. We just going up to people's houses, stealing all their money. <laughs> we got some borgus, some fancy mushroom. We can come over here and shake the trees and get some crumb berries. I just love going around town and just collecting everything because everything comes in handy later. So Ava's in here. Girl, I thought I'd just seen you at your house. You walk pretty fast. So this is the learnery where we would come and talk to Regnalia. Oh, hey, how's the grandma at working out for you? No unscheduled explosions, I take it. Uns unscheduled explosions? What? That magic book thingy I gave you. It's called a grand boy. Oh, that. So far, it's been pretty useful, but also inert. Good, good. I'm nearly certain it will stay that way. Hopefully, girl, I don't need it uh, exploding on me and stuff. So over here is where you would come to scan your new found ooblets, but I guess we can't do that right now. Um, and whenever you find new ooblets, you go to the earnery, scan them, and they will give you some gummies. So that's a good way to earn some money too. Here is Melda over here. Oh, hi again. We never got properly introduced. I'm Melda, the friend friend's club leader. Hi, Melda. I'm Zarela. Very cute name. Welcome to town. Thank you, girl. Let's go into Cuddle Cups Cafe so I can show y'all all around here. So cute. Yes. And we just got random townsfolk up in here. They're just sitting down eating this stuff. Um, Perfect. I'm a supporter of smaller government. That's why I always vote for the shorter candidate. I'm big. Gertz. All of my life decisions are designed around increasing my chance of space travel. Okay, Melbourne. Friends are like virtual assistants who don't know the temperature. Okay. And tell us, what angle does a baseball hat have to be on my head to signal that I'm a cool dude this day? <laughs> I'm dead. What angle? I'm dead. So there's some bean juice, some spicy, and some ground beans over here. Um, but let's just come and talk to... Ooh, I don't got no money for that. Let's talk to Double. Mm -hmm. They say that if you have a job you love, you'll never need to take a vacation. I really need a vacation. So in this game, you want to go around talking to all the townsfolk so you can get, um, so you can become better friends with them and they will also give you some gifts once you become better friends with them. What do you need for the, we have to have two sweetie beauties to get a clomper. I really want a clomper. So, but let's just go ahead and shake this tree so we can get these whips that we're gonna need eventually. We got a little, the incidentals remain unrelated to the presence. Operations continue as planned, operative. I don't know, those are always on that bench, so I don't know what they are. But let's go collect these quip, these other quibs over here. And I'm also gonna collect this spore bag. And then we're gonna come over here and talk to Mazer Tinsel. And we're gonna reopen the town hall. You. So it says, nice, you found the town again. You probably noticed my open office layout and that's it, card boxes, Aww. cardboard boxes. Turns out an aggressive little clicky claws has made town hall its home. Yeah. Every time I try to go in, it starts biting my ankles. I guess they voted for the other guy. Maybe if you make a big show of beating them in a dance battle, it'll be enough to give them to leave. So I can start using my office. Be prepared, they're right on the other side of this door. Okay, so we need to regain access to town hall. So let's go ahead and go inside. And let's see if we can dance and battle these ghouls. Yes, we need to dance with Clicky Claws. Look how cute Clicky Claws is. A little cute creature with the little mad face. <laughs> and we're gonna go against you and I'm gonna get your seed, okay? Well, hopefully we can get that seed. All right, so we gotta get to 20 points. Let's do this 
Give it strut for four points. Hey, shake your booty. Shake your booty. Then we're gonna do the little lady for two points. And then your turn doing your clicky cards. What you got? The dainty dip. Okay, dainty dip. The twizzle sizzle. Alright, and then we can do this one, the flip flops for seven points. Or we can do this, two points. Four, five, six. Okay, I'm just gonna do this one. Um, and get the seven points. And then now, still turn, they're gonna get one point. They use their special move. And then they're gonna get do the twizzle sizzle. Day to dip. Okay, they catching up to us. Uh -uh, we can't let that happen. Let's go ahead and gain a beat and do the rhythm and grow. And then we're going to do the shake it and earn six points. Hey, we at 90. We finna win. And then we're gonna do the gather track for four points. And we won. For like period. Town Hall is back ours. Okay, so. Shramba, you're so cute. <laughs> yes, let's get the seed from Clicky Claw so we can have a little Clicky Claw oublet. You little nasty. <laughs> All right, we're gonna need to go and plant our lump stump and our Clicky Claw seed. I knew you could do it. it. I totally had, I totally had it come to terms with the. Per permanence of my cardboard outdoor office. Now that I can use Town Hall, we can get started on all the projects I have planned to save Bitch Town. Here's what I'm thinking. Y'all, let me see what your plans are, honey. Fix the friendship sticker, printing press, repair the old forearm house, help Rugnolia start her oblet research project, and reconstitute all the mystery cans. Okay, and then we have some other tasks that are locked, but yeah, I know there's a lot to do. First thing you should do is fix up, fix up your house. It's a bit of an eyesore. You can also see what else needs to be done by walking around town. All right, anywho, I'll be moving into my new office here if you need me. All right, Tenzo. We reopened the town hall. So now we just need to um, fix our house. So let's just go back to our house. Let's go back to our house, plant these little seeds, see what we need to do to be able to fix our house. Ooh, we got some mail. It took me way too long to figure this out, so you might not know yet. You can find nurnies and rocks laying around your farm. Best way to get them. Here are a couple I've already found. Thanks, Ava. Thank you, girl. All right, so we're going to need to repair our old townhouse. And to repair it, we're going to need 12 planklets, 8 nurnies. See those nurnies? that era just gave us came in handy and five cloth lets so we have one cloth let we can go ahead and do it we have four nurnies and we have five plank lets so we can get the rest all lighter but we're gonna go ahead and till the ground so we can get these um little ooblets these different ooblets and we're gonna plant our lump stump, and we're going to also plant um, little clicky claw. Oh, we're gonna have two more babies, and then we need to go ahead and water them and see how long it takes for them to grow. It takes them both one day, so we'll be seeing them tomorrow. So yeah, y'all, that's gonna be it for the first episode of my Ooblets Let's Play series. And I'm so excited for all the other episodes. I know y'all are wondering, like, girl, are you really gonna keep up with this series and stuff? Y'all, I'm loving this game. It's a fresh new game. So yes, I'm definitely gonna be keeping up with this series. So expect way more episodes. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this one. Don't forget to go and check out the link down below so you can download this game yourself because it is very addicting. And as y'all can see, it's a very cute game and the music is poppy y'all it's poppy but yeah y'all so hopefully y'all enjoyed this video if you did then leave a like and a sweet 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 comment down below thank you again epic games for sponsoring this video and i will see y'all in my next motherfucking video bye <laughs>